as, as we look at our minds, we, we, we begin to understand more and more what, what this craving is uh, that the Buddha is talking about and how much it dominates our, our, our lives. It's something that's quite uh, shocking, disturbing to, uh, to recognize within ourselves. It's not something that we, we like to uh, admit, uh, perhaps, that um, so much of our, our conduct is guided by the desire for pleasant feelings which arise through sense contacts of various kinds. Um, how much we're, we're dominated by desire to be, to become, uh, to become famous, well-known, successful, loved, respected, um, and so on. The desire to, craving to get rid of things we don't like. So, um, these, there are these three kinds of, of desire which the Buddha pointed us to, uh, to look at and investigate. Desire for, um, for sense pleasures, and the desire to become something, and the desire to get rid of things. And um, the more we look closely at our lives, the more clearly we see these things, um, then the more we see the, the importance of, of practice. Um, because without the practice of the Eightfold Path, there's no way that we can really um, deal with this very deep, um, deep-seated cravings which, which forms the core of our, um, of our usual life and existence.